Star say you crazy. YouTube, let's get, get, get it. Back with another vid, YouTube. It's your boy Big Gap. Today I'm out with my Armor Outcast 4S, running 4S. I got the Power Hobby belted tires on here. My boy JT put them on his Creighton. And uh, I was like, man, let me give it a try on my Outcast and see how good they do. Trying to see how well they perform out here. It's crazy because she's not bung they're they not bungling around no more. Like how they was doing on my Erevo. Oh. Well, they still bungling a little bit. I guess I gotta break them in. Holding the ground pretty good. Whoa. You can tell they're heavy. Yeah, they'll hold, they don't hold as straight. You have to turn them, turn them back straight. Instead of the servo having enough power to put them back straight. See, when I turn, they kind of linger off a little bit. But ain't nothing I can't handle. Oh, I might have to take this one to the street races, fellas. I can race this one pretty good. Break, turn. They struggle though. It struggles with it. It definitely struggles. It just made a popping sound on that last turn. Also, fellas, my shock went back bad again. My shock went back bad again, so I gotta order another set, set of shocks. Alright, fellas, I'm back. Yeah, they a little they a little heavy for it. But it's, it's gripping the street pretty good. It's doing pretty good. Still got the, the power to Willie. <laughs> Try to see if I can get up the full throttle. Full throttle. Hmm. Full throttle. <laughs> she doing pretty good. She doing pretty good. This where I don't really like belted tires. Uh, you know, especially low profile belted tires. Because my Proline belted tires, they do pretty good. And my belted tires, my uh, Duratrax belted that I got on the X Max, they do pretty good because the profile is not so low. But on these power hobbies and the SRCs, to me, this where it, it, it hurts the most. Even though they, they, they you know, they supposed to be all terrain, they kind of struggle in the, uh, in the in the in the loose grass, loose dirt. They struggle a little bit, kind of sways around. For me, you know what I'm saying. Some people like it, but for me, I don't really like it like that. But on the street, they're definitely awesome on the street. See how a three wheel, it was up on three wheels. That's how you could tell they is it they heavy. And when you come out of a turn and you hit the throttle hard, see look at that, three wheels. <laughs> the front one of the front wheels don't be on the ground all the way. And they definitely don't do that with the stop. That's how you can tell they're a little bit heavy for this platform. For the temp scale platform.
Three wheel motion, baby. Watch three wheel motion. <laughs> three wheel. <laughs> Performing pretty well though. Performing pretty well. I have to give it that. So I may try to take this to the races, to the street races. <laughs> See what it can do. I'm also gonna get them out to the to the uh, to the um, to the dirt races as well. I'm gonna put the uh, regular the regular uh, backflips back on there. I'm gonna get it out to the dirt races as well because people don't believe that I can race an outcast, which I've done it before. I've raced my six S one before, and I was successful. It just was before I was doing YouTube, uh, before I was you know big into the YouTube doing my my YouTube channel. But uh, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you that this outcast can actually race. It's all about your throttle control. It's all about your throttle control. Um, so just a quick video, man. I like them on here a little bit, but it's not something that they have to stay on here. You know what I'm saying? It just was a, it was a, it was a nice test. Now, now I know, you know how they how they do on here. But uh, I appreciate y'all sticking around watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, dislike, whatever you like. YouTube, and I'm in it.